This is an unboxing video of the Lenovo ThinkVision P24H. I'm still configuring it and putting it together. I was able to set up the stand on my uh, new desk on which I have my Lenovo ThinkPad T470 with the dock mounted on the dock on a Lenovo ThinkPad dock. Uh, so I just finished or I'm in the process of almost finishing the unboxing put in the display and then I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be recording a video when I unpack it completely out of there there's the monitor so there. here's the monitor itself this is the monitor itself uh, they have two sizes if I'm not mistaken there's the P27 for 27 inches and this is the P24 for the 24 inches uh, diagonally. The resolution, I do not know the exact resolution, but it's way higher than, way higher than 1920 by, by, by 1080. It's way higher than that. It's supposed to be a QHD, if I'm not mistaken. So look how beautiful that is. Look at that beautiful monitor. Look at that beautiful monitor. Look at this beautiful monitor. I love it. Previously, Lenovo logo, previously I was using a TV. Temporarily, I was using a television, an HD TV. There's the power source. Uh, there are your um, HDMI out and in put and a USB type C. There's a USB type C as well. Well, right now I'm gonna go mount it on the bracket. Uh, I hope I don't drop this. I'm gonna mount it on the bracket now. Here is the bracket. So I'll film when I have it mounted. Okay, and I just finished mounting it on the bracket on the stand and it's beautiful. It is beautiful. So now what I'm gonna do is that uh, as I told you guys, I'm not gonna be using the USB type C cable because since I have a ThinkPad, uh, I have a ThinkPad 470, 470S. So the 470, unfortunately, when, when Lenovo came up with this model about two years ago, the USB type C port, it's on the right hand side only. It only has one on the right on the on the on the right hand side. You can see the port is right in there. So they don't it doesn't have a port on the on the left hand side of the computer and the uh, the Lenovo dock has no support for USB type C either. So it is very inconvenient if I'm gonna have to be Every time that I dock the computer, I'm gonna have to be um, having to connect it on the side of the cable is sticking out on the right side of the my desk and my desk uh, setup ends uh, it ends around this area, so it's, it's it is not convenient. So what I'm gonna be using as a connection type is gonna be a combination of um, HDMI. And I'm gonna use the regular power core supply by Lenovo. Uh, so I'll have another video when I do that connection. Sure, Thank you. The Think Vision. The Think Vision P24. So this is the type of setup I'm gonna be using HDMI. Okay, so and it has support for a lot of other type of input. Oh, by the way, it does not have sound. So I'm going to have to be buying a set of wireless Bluetooth so here speakers. are my connections. I have set up the power supply and one HDMI cable that will lead to the uh, ThinkPad uh, dock, where my ThinkPad is. Okay, so this is the stand, and it's already on the... Uh, on its own uh, uh, bracket and uh, it is uh, it has a lot of uh, flexibility so you can push it 
it'll be uh, just a downwards and upwards. So I'm gonna go ahead, let me move the bananas out of the way. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'll turn, turn it on now. I'm gonna turn it on. So I'm turning on. Hey, what happened? Oh, there it is. So I'm turning on the, com the computer. I'm turning on my ThinkPad right now. Look at that beautiful keyboard illuminating. I don't have the brand of the keyboard, but it's very nice. All right, so I'm gonna log in. You see my fingerprints. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is uh, for the very first time, I'm gonna turn the monitor on. And there it goes. What does it say there? ThinkPad, Lenovo. M my apologies, Think Vision. But it read out as Lenovo. So now, it's the uh, time to configure the display. So let me see what I, I'm going to attempt to identify the displays first. Let me attempt to identify the displays. Display settings. So display settings. Uh, detect. I am attempting to detect the display. Uh, but it's not allowing me to detect it. It's not allowing me to detect it. It's not It's not detecting the display. So at this point, I'm gonna try to figure out as to why. Why is not allowing me to detect the display output? It could be that I put in the uh, other side of the HDMI cable on the wrong, uh, on the wrong uh, hub. Or it could be that, um, or it could be that uh, I may have to restart the computer. Okay, and it's showing that it's on power mode. All right, I'm gonna troubleshoot it. Okay, I think I might have just found out what is going on. What I have to do is uh, select the type of input. So what I'm gonna do is select uh, HDMI one. And let's see if that fixes the issue. I'm gonna try it again. I am going to select HDMI 1. DP HDMI. There. Oh, that didn't do anything. I'm going to try it again. Oh, I'm going to try it again. Is that an excellent me? I'm going to try it again. Okay, there we go again. Oh, that's HDMI 2, HDMI, HDMI 1, there. So what do I do? Select. That's what I want to do, select. But again, I'm not getting any output, so I'm going to try it again, and I'm going to try this time HDMI 2, and see if that helps. There, HDMI 2. See if I get any output. I'm not getting anything. Oh, I'll still play around with it. I'm gonna continue playing around with the type of input and maybe that resolves the issue. But as of now, I'm not able to to get a, an output on the display. All mode. right, I finally got it. I finally got it. Uh, so as you can see here, I'm getting the complete output of the, of the monitor. So again, this is how the monitor looks and all its uh, beauty i'm gonna we're gonna go over the settings now and we're gonna check what's the resolution of the settings the maximum uh, resolution that it has so on the display and monitor as you can see this will be monitor two so the display the uh, resolution here is uh, oh it has a maximum of 20 2560 by 1440 but again what i'm doing here is i'm duplicating display what i want to do is switch over and um my thinkpad i want to carry it over to the think vision p24 so i'm going to extend i am going to show only on display two and that should only show this monitor there we go 
now the ThinkPad turned off the display and I have everything on this monitor. So now that I did this, what I want to do now is check what's my resolution. Uh, let me see, advanced scaling. Nope, that doesn't change any resolution. So what I'm going to do is uh, extend display. Once I extend the display, uh, okay, for now I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna hit keep, and I'm gonna change the resolution here to the highest possible resolution, which is already set as, at the highest possi possible resolution, and I'm gonna display it only, on, on display the output only on, on uh, monitor two, which is the P800. So here we go, keep changes. Okay, so here we go. There you go. Um, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the maximum maximum uh, resolution the P24 should be, it should be 2540 by, is it 1448? I'm gonna find out now. Okay, let me type uh, Lenovo Think Vision. P24 um, should be that one. So I'm gonna look at the specifications. P24. Oh. Let's look up the specifications. Oh yes, that's that beauty. There it is. Okay, let's look at the. Let's take a look at the resolution. The maximum resolution. Yes. So here is the resolution. The maximum resolution is 2560 by 1440. And I have the this P24 right now. I have it connected to I have it connected to um, uh, via HDMI. It's connected uh, via so HDMI. So I have now so I have now adjusted the the uh, Think Vision P24 to the maximum to the maximum resolution allowed, which is 2560, 2560 by, by 1440. And the, uh, the display, the display uh, sizes of text is at 100%. I like it better at 100% because if I put it at 120, this is how it looks. So everything becomes like uh, bloated. So I prefer at 100% since I'm very close to the display. I don't really have an inconvenience. Uh, so you can see how sharp and how small the text looks. Look at that. This is a full 2560 by 1440 resolution. And you can see there uh, how many uh, how many windows I can have open, how many folders I can have open. Look. And files as well. So I'm gonna keep I'm gonna continue to tinker and play around with the uh, the settings, but uh, I wouldn't want to mess with the uh, factory defaulted calibration. So I prefer to leave it uh, as Lenovo intended it to to be, unless I was doing some sort of gaming or other type of advanced graphics, which I'm not because my ThinkPad, uh, my ThinkPad. T470s is not a a uh, gaming uh, laptop. It's just like for uh, work and office related um, uh, tasks. It is okay, connected guys. via HDMI. Think Vision. So this is a uh, unboxing and installing of the Think Vision P24. The size of the display is 23.8 inches. Diagonally, and the uh, type of display is an IPS QHD, and it does come with a, a, mon a Type C connection. But uh, I do not know of what any good is a Type uh, a USB Type C connection. What since I have a ThinkPad uh, 470, like I was telling you, and my 470 ThinkPad is connected to a dock, and the dock does not support USB Type C. So in that case, it makes no sense 
as to why um, ha why would I have to connect it directly to the computer when at a moment's notice I need I would need to um, undock it and take it with me. So I like to have a one 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 connection for all type of uh, uh, type of setup. So in the event that I have to just undock the computer, I don't have to I don't have to uh, I wouldn't have to uh, disconnect a second cable. So uh, I mean that is my my uh, uh, the way I like to have my setup. But uh, other other uh, other people might, would prefer having the would prefer to have the the um, uh, USB Type C connection. But then again, I do not know if it offers better resolution or just the convenience of having a, a video, audio, and power out uh, in one cable. Uh, I don't mind having it uh, connected with a separate power cable and having it uh, via HD, connected via HDMI because uh, uh, I have a large power bar there. So, uh, as you can see, I have a lot of connect, connect, connections there. And, and again, I have a dedicated fuse for my desktop alone because I'm not using the AC the ac um, as you can see there those are uh, outlets so that one is dedicated directly dedicated to the um um uh, to the um uh the power box in the house the electrical power uh, box and uh it has a dedicated fuse just for that so i don't run any risk of getting um uh, overloading power or anything like that so thank you again for uh, watching my video on the unboxing unboxing and installing of the Think Vision P24 23.8 inch wide IPS display with a maximum resolution of uh, 25 um, uh, uh, 50 by 1440 25 25 60 by 1440 and it is an IPS QHD display I love this monitor